All right, man, 210 Boxing TV. Here are David, the North Central Prince. Got it in his three, you know, he moved to three and oh, three knockouts tonight. Talk about your performance and the fight and what you think about the stoppage? Well, it was a good fight. I had a, it was a, I had a decent performance. Could have done a lot better, more combinations, throw more punches, but you no, know, I was I'm a slow starter. I'm a slow starter, so. Yeah. A, lot, a lot of people knew about you in the amateurs. Talk about the move to the pros and being able to carry that power. You know, you're not just winning on decision, you're, you're scoring knockouts. And it seems like your pivots, your sidesteps, and your right hand is really helping you out. Talk about that. Uh, yeah, um, you know, the amateur was way different. Headgear, uh, you know, headgear, bigger, bigger gloves. For pros, uh, smaller, smaller gloves, no headgear, you know. Big difference. You feel the punches, getting hit with them, and hitting with them. So, yeah, and it, it's, it's a big difference. San Antonio is known for being a fight town, right? You got Bam, Josh, Mario was here tonight. Can we expect you to be the next guy from San Antonio? Of course, of course. That's what I, I'm, me, me, Lil Ricky, and a few others. The, the next one out of San Antonio for sure to be, be, be next world champions. You I, got, think, I think me and Ricky are the next ones up for sure. You got Kelton, you got Bam, you got Josh, all these guys backing you. What does that mean for them to back you? Because it doesn't seem like... It's just like, okay, like, you know, casual, like, hey, you know, I support you. Like, these guys, they walk out, walk with you to the ring. It's real love, real support. What is that like? It's a blessing, you know. Not everyone can have them, have people like them, you know, supporting them, being with them, you know. And it's, it's a blessing. Not everyone can have that. And I, and I really appreciate them for that. It just seems like more and more on these shows, right, you keep you keep showing out. What can we expect from you in the future, and where do you see yourself? But right now, you're fighting at 115, right? Yeah. Do you feel like you're gonna stay at that weight, or what do you see? What do you see yourself in the my, future my eventually class, filling out? My true weight class is 105. I'm gonna go down 105 whenever I can. You got way down 105. Uh, yeah, get, I'm, I, I, I weighed in at 113, so yeah, it's, it's easy. I mean, I walk around 117, so yeah, uh, 105 be, be my worst for my first world champion champion there at 105 and move up. You, you kind of gonna follow in the steps of Bam, like you know how Bam. Yeah. Well, he started at 108, but he didn't win a title, but then he moved up to 115. But you're actually going to win the title, you feel like, at 105, yeah, 108, sure. move up? I feel like I'm, I'm way bigger. You know, this guy was at 115. I was way bigger than him. I feel like I have that advantage. I'm, I'm a big, I'm going to be a big 105-pounder. I was a big 106-pounder in amateurs. I feel like I'm going to be a big 105-pounder in, in, in the pros. All right, man. Anything you want to leave off with tonight? And let the fans know where they catch you on social media. Uh, you want to thank all my sponsors, uh, all my supporters, you know, all my family, my friends. We appreciate them. Without them, none of this is possible. And you no, know, I just wanna wanna, wanna thank them. And on to the next one. Hopefully in November. All right, man. David, the North Central Prince, got in this. We out.